Okay, guys, I'm at work and I just feel something hard in my mouth. And when uh, let me put it, this piece more of my teeth came out. So. Oh, see? By the time I go to the dentist to remove them, that's next week, Thursday. There's not going to be nothing for them to remove. Well, I have to remove three kids. Remember, I only have three left. I don't know where the next one just disappeared to. So I definitely have to take out two and a half if there's any leaving that half. So look, this is it right here. So you all can imagine the pain. I just take a pain pill, the pain that I'm feeling. Oh Lord, it's so painful. I can't wait um, to remove it Thursday, to remove them Thursday so I don't have to go through all these pain again. <sighs> so finally, I decided to come see the dentist again after feeling this toothache for over two months. So as I'm showing you guys here, um, I only have three with some tea leaves. For some reason, the next one fall out, and I do not know when or how. Yes, I did fill my teeth the other day, and when I did the fillings, all my wisdom teeth was there. Everything was perfectly fine. And yes, guys, I did wear Invisalign in the past, and they work very well for my teeth. So here I am sitting in the dentist chair, there, just checking to see what's going on, and they did make me an appointment for the following Thursday. I wish I had an earlier date, but that's the earliest they have. And I did get that day off. So they're not gonna put me to sleep, guys. No, they're not gonna put me to sleep. I will be awakened. They said I could have go back to work that same day, but I couldn't do no heavy lifting or hold my head down. And I wasn't allowed to spit. So I'll bring you guys on this vlog to let you know everything that happened. Because I don't know if you all go through the same thing that, you know, with your wisdom teeth. Because I know I hear a lot of our story about wisdom teeth. This is my first time going through it. And that's the main reason I'm pulling the three teeth that leave. So here she's showing the piece of broke off teeth that I have. It broke off in the middle and then... In the beginning, you guys see me showing you there's piece more, like they've fallen on a piece by piece. So I'll let you guys know how much is left by the time I go pull my teeth out. So you all can see the little break off right there. So she's oh, showing them. Way, baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hang on, Chuck, you're trying to get him. Mm -hmm. Choke you trying to get back there and get it out. I used to drink coffee because I do overnight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, you still do overnight? No, I switched between to 11, but the coffee used to wait me up. Mm -hmm. What you do, security? Mm -mm. Listen, I used mm -hmm. to do security. That's the worst mm -hmm. thing to do at mm -hmm. night. Mm -hmm. right? mm -hmm. But 
and it was for a gated community. Mm -hmm. So sometimes cars wouldn't come in for hours. Mm -hmm. And you know, if you get caught sleeping, you can lose your job. Uh -huh. I used to try to get up and try uh -huh. to walk around. And no coffee? I never tried really coffee, but I should have did something. Mm -hmm. but that's why I got into dentistry because I was like with the kids, the mm -hmm. hours would work out. Yeah. But is it working? It's working, right? It's, it's okay. We work one Saturday, but my kids are getting older. Okay. So they, we work one Saturday a week. I get a second job. Oh, really? Oh, <laughs> Lord. It is. There's a lot of cost of living and here in Florida. Is <laughs> and I go ahead and I use the salt, warm water salt flush, and I soak my teeth with it when I get up in the morning. I feel I'm chewing on something. The night when I do the salt water first, I feel a pop. Uh, Hello. Okay. <laughs> and then I realize a piece of my teeth come out. So, so I'm here to remove it. So I tried to get an x-ray, but I'm about to choke them. <laughs> 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 infection yet, so I have to get them removed ASAP because as I say, in the middle of my teeth, I use a salt water flush and when I get up in the morning, I feel a popped piece of thing in my mouth and then I take it out and it's the, my teeth when I look behind. It's the middle, in the middle of my wisdom teeth. So the teeth is still plugged in, but in the middle, there's nothing, it's just my gum. So I can't eat on that side. But yeah, I just can't wait for them to remove and for them to open and eat so I can eat my food and actually taste my food. So I just keep you guys updated um, through this process. And I do ask if I can work because I was trying to get that day off. But I asked the surgeon if I can work that day after I remove my teeth, and he said yes. As long as I'm not going to talk on the phone or lift anything heavy, I'll be okay. So let's see. I'll keep you guys updated on that too.